Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today we're going to talk about my 2021 wish list. I'm excited about this video because I really have thought about this like deeply and I'm really sure of the things that I want so let's just get into this video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Lou and I film videos about handbags, shoes, Chanel, Louis Vuitton, Hermes and those brands. So if you're interested in those topics, please consider subscribing to my channel and click the notification bell down below so you don't miss any of my videos. I don't think like, I hope that I can, but I don't think that I'm gonna be able to buy everything on this list, of course. So I don't know, I just feel like if you don't have a wish list, you cannot really stay focused on the items that you want to buy. So I just really like doing them. All also, yes, sometimes I even change my wish list more so at the end of the year. So I'm gonna probably do an update on this video in a couple of months to see which items I got, which items I don't really want anymore. But yeah, I just want to remind you that not because things are on my list, that will mean that I'm gonna buy them. First of all, because I cannot afford to buy everything that is on this list by any means whatsoever. So this is just for fun. So the first bag on the list is going to be something that everyone would have guessed. And if you know, I bought my Birkin recently and this is my Birkin 25 in noir with gold hardware in Togo leather but the day that I bought that bag I was actually offered two Birkins and the other one was in gold color that this is like a tan brown color same size uh, also Togo leather I know if that day I would have chosen the gold one instead of this one I would still think about this one too so there was no right or no wrong like both of them are gorgeous I don't know I cannot stop thinking about the gold one so I want to save for it and I want to buy it and I'm gonna try to do it this summer so yeah my, my first plan the first bag that I want to buy if I can find it is going to be a uh, Birkin in 25 size I think I would be open to a 30 maybe to try it out in the color gold in togo leather with gold hardware with the contrast stitching that is the white one I just feel like I I need to complete the day in my wardrobe I, I just want it I know that this is like a really long shot I'm not really sure if I'm gonna be able to do it but I just want to have it on the list second on my list I actually have a picture and it's maybe a Kelly or a Birkin like I'm fine either way this is the last Hermes piece that I have on my list and obviously this is like a, this is a huge long shot but I wanted to mention it anyway and no I'm not gonna only buy Hermes from now on I only have two on the list and those two are the only ones that I want to buy uh, but I kind of want a gray either Birkin or Kelly Kelly I would love it to be on a 25 size in Epson leather with the thing is I want it gray any shade of gray is fine I think I prefer it on the darker side with rose gold hardware that would be amazing so I kind of wanted to have another option in case I didn't find the gold one so gray is an amazing color and I'm fine if it's a Birkin or a Kelly open to both bags I really love them both I think that would actually be really cool and I just I don't know I'm I'm interested in seeing how that looks but yeah of course this is a a long shot and I need to save a ton of money to be able to make it happen so I don't really feel like I'm gonna get two Hermes bags this year so I actually think that it would be really cool to share a video about my Hermes wishlist like the full wishlist of all the bags that I would like to get eventually not for this year but like lifetime wishlist so if you're interested in that video please let me know in the comments down below so I can maybe make that happen and it would be really fun because it's it's obviously like a dream never gonna happen type of video but I feel like it's so much fun to talk about the things that we like and I want to start doing some more Hermes content because I saw that you guys really like that so yeah if you're interested let me know in the comment section down below the next two are from Chanel so I have two classic flops on my wish list and I don't really think that I'm gonna get both because Chanel price increases have been getting really out of my reach I think that I want to get them vintage or pre-loved at least it would be really nice to get them new and from store but but let's be realistic, probably pre-loved and vintage. And actually, I really love vintage bags. So I want a white lambskin. Caviar is okay, but I prefer lambskin. White or ivory classic flop with gold hardware. That would be amazing. And the second one would be a beige vintage classic flop. But the beige one, I wanted like really, really vintage.
vintage like more than 20 years type of bag with gold hardware and I would like it either medium or small and I just want to find it I have been seeing a lot on social media especially Instagram vintage classic flaps the flattened quilts I love them the age of the bag I just I don't know a true bag lover will always be able to appreciate like really old vintage bags if they're properly cared for so I really want two vintage bags and one is white and the other one is beige next one is a 19 bag and I have been talking about this for so so long so I really want a 19 bag that is tweed or any other type of material I don't really want another leather one I have this one but yeah I want maybe tweed or I don't know what's the other material that they use that it makes it look like a plushy very very puffy I love it I'm looking into that but I think I would get the other ones before the 19 bag maybe if I had like an amazing deal I would do it but other than that I think I would get the other ones first like you know always when you get amazing deals you, you really have to go for it if you can and you have the means but really I'm really happy with my 19 bag I love the bag it's truly amazing so yeah I kind of want another one and the last one this is the first time that you're gonna hear me want jewelry and both are from Cartier and I went to the store the other day and sadly they made me try everything on with gloves so it was very strange I didn't really have a chance to grasp a real feeling of how they would look on me because I had like a huge glove because my hands are actually tiny and the glove was massive so it didn't really work out but I made up my mind and I really want a just to include ring and I want a Cartier love bracelet I want them the very plain and simple I'm not really into diamonds maybe on a necklace and if it was like only one diamond or an engagement ring but I don't really like the flashy type of vibe like don't get me wrong I love them and I appreciate them and they're obviously super expensive for a reason and that is because they're diamonds but I really like the plain gold situation so yeah oh and I checked my size and I'm a size 6 on the just to include and a size 16 on the Cartier love bracelet so I'm really I'm really hoping to get one of either one of those for this year because I don't know I have put jewelry on the back of my wish list constantly and right now I just really want to get into it a little bit more I hope to not get really caught up with that because jewelry can be way more expensive than bags so I just want to do it a little bit not too much just a little bit with two pieces and the last one is from Dior and I really want a Dior saddlebag but it's uh, the last thing on my list I don't really want to push it it can happen I don't really feel like I'm gonna really actively try to save for one because the other ones will go first because um yeah it's Hermes and, and Chanel I don't really have anything from Louis Vuitton this year because I had the mini watch Chabot for my wish list but I kind of I got the necklace version and I think I'm okay with that I don't really feel the need to buy the mini one anymore because they are like too too similar and either way the mini one doesn't fit a phone and the necklace one will make pretty much the same function as the other one so I'm happy with that one I can try to think of something from Louis Vuitton that I would buy this year but I honestly don't know I'm not I don't really find the need for any other Louis Vuitton bag as this specific right moment so yeah I think my savings and my efforts are gonna go towards Chanel and Hermes this year and probably I'm gonna buy way less bags and items just to be able to get like the big items first because price increases are killing me I can't keep doing this I need to get my Chanel wish list done like before they reach astronomical prices we need to get that done now now so this was it I would love to know which bags you have on your wish list or jewelry or whatever I really like to see what other people want to buy for this year and the reasons they have behind it so please consider dropping a comment with your wish list and like this video I just want to thank you all because every time my videos perform like really great is because of the engagement and that means comments and likes so I really appreciate every time you do and just like you give me the time of your day to watch my videos and if you're new to my channel please consider subscribing and click the notification bell down below so you don't miss any of my videos and if you're not done I'm gonna leave you another video right here so please consider going to watch that and yeah thank you so much and see you on the next time bye